All right, drivers, this is uh, Ron and Kurt again. Uh, this is another training video on the ELD unit. So uh, just assume that you're already logged into the unit and you've done, you've gone through your uh, the login situation and you're in and you're at this screen, which is the old AOBRD screen. All right, so you need to go to the ELD screen. You touch this button and it brings up the ELD screen. Right? You can see at the top that you have two icons there. There's a red trailer and there's a red file. The red trailer means that you do not have any trailer numbers entered onto your log. The red file means that you do not have any, any uh, shipper numbers entered onto your log. Now this is something that you have to do daily and you can only have on your log the trailers and shippers you're using for any given day. And at the end of the day, when you're finished, you have to leave them in there. And then the next day when you come back, you get rid of them, you remove them, and you put the new ones, the, the ones that you just, you're starting that particular day with. So from this screen, you can see here at the bottom, you've got a shipments button and a trailer button. And the icons match the red icons that are up at the top. So let's start with shipments. You touch shipments, and this is where you add a shipment. So you touch this field here, it brings up the keyboard, change it to numbers, add a shipper number. Just touch it here, and it will throw the one you just entered in over here. As you go through your day, you're going to have to enter other ones. Just enter a shipper number, hit it, get a third one. And it's in there. So now you can see that the shipments are in here, and as you go through your day, you're just going to leave them in there. At the end of the day, you log out, leave them in there. Your, your log for that day will record these shipper numbers for that particular day. When you get in in the, in the, the next day to start your, your, your work, before you go to add any new shippers, you can just check this box right here. There's a little gray box. If you touch that you'll see that they all get checked. So let's say that this one down here was the one that you ended yesterday with, and it's the one that you're starting today with. Just uncheck that one, and then touch remove, and it's the only one that's left. Now you're good to start your day with your shippers. Go to the home screen. Trailers is basically the same thing. Put in a trailer number. It brings up the keyboard, five, three, one, two, three, four, check. Say so you get a second trailer throughout the day, five, three, one, nine, eight, seven, check. As you go through your day, you add trailers. When you're done at the end of the day, leave them in there, just like with the shipper numbers, and check at the top when you get in in the next morning. If this is the trailer that you're going to use to start your day with, just uncheck and hit remove. And now you're ready to go. You have the shipper number you're starting with, and you have the trailer number you're starting with. And if you look at the top, now that you have a number in each one, the icons are gone. There's no trailer. There's no file. You have to do this every day. Please don't leave days and days worth of trailers and shipper numbers in your e-logs. You need to update this as you go through each day. All right, drivers, that's how you add and remove trailers and shipper numbers from your logs. Please get on top of that and make sure it happens.